me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker. Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Love that shot. Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again. Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep? Please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Captain, I've got eyes on a Fisk construction site and their equipment's covered in dust. Just there for show? That's my bet. I'm gonna take a closer look. They think the boss can't run things from inside? They don't know the boss. A lot of people owe him a lot of favors, that's for sure. I th Got eyes on Spider-Man! Oh, Get him! You got this coming! Open wide! Take him down before he knocks us all out! Come on, stop me! What the hell was that? I'll teach you some respect! Heads up! He's airborne! Keep him on the ground! Get ready to do the game! Get down here and fight like a man! Drugs in the concrete mix. That's my theory. We'll need probable cause to get on site to confirm it. You'll have it. This will shut your mouth. Bring them down already. You won't do that twice. I'm gonna blow your brains out. Ten more. No shoving. I'll give you all personal attention. I'm in an ass kicking mood. Keep them on the 
Captain, I've got Fisk's guys and all the probable cause you need, webbed up and waiting. Good job. Fisk thinks he can run things from inside, but he's gonna find out why long-distance relationships don't work out. Excuse me. Set her straight. You're on with J. Jonah Jenkins. I just want to say that I've never seen Manhattan so safe and peaceful. Compare what it was like when Spider Man first showed up to now. Okay, fair enough. I will. Then. Sneak it off. Spider Man! How are we supposed to do against that? You ain't no cop! You got no right! Oops! Hit him, 
Lost so much for getting all of them. with my adoring public. I better stop them before they end up in driver's head videos. Time no see. Now that's just. Reinforcements. I guess this is what they call organized crime. Give that real man props. Manhattan rush hour is no joke. Get out of here, Spider-Man. We'll handle the cleanup.
You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong! Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York. Keeper. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Empire State University, the old alma mater, and holder of my student loans.
Lindo, but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place. Someone's getting robbed. Oh, you started without me. the holdup guys are phoning it in lately. Thank you. I always thought this would protect me. I was wrong. Police reports show a rash of break-ins recently. The victim of one of them is here with us now. What happened, ma'am? Well, my business was broken into. A flower shop. Who breaks into a flower shop? I was cleaned out. I, I couldn't believe it. I, I thought the area was safe. I see Spider-Man around all the time. My dear, you learned the hard way, the sad truth about Spider-Man. He only cares about the glory. Something as, forgive me, prosaic as a break-in and robbery is beneath his notice. Do not rely on him to keep your property safe. The only thing he truly values is his own massive ego. Wild guess. Those guys breaking in don't live there. Ever hear a knocking? You ain't ready for this. Pro tip, 
If you're not good at breaking or entering, maybe don't pull a B and E. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just pull me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking! But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level! Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. <laughs> gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I'm done talking! Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Said enough. Move, move, move! like zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. It looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You up late? Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah. Whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. 
the idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume says psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets out, my life's over. Give me the plans and it won't. Very nice. Just what I needed. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this. And I leaked the photo. Looking good, Spidey. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No. I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. I'm losing them! Another victim? Or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Took you long enough. Okay. Yeah. As soon as he saw the photo, he fell in line. Rodrigo always was a sucker. Gotcha! Boss will be happy. Let's see the plans. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta catch my train. Don't wanna keep the boss up. And it's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Getting off. Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, 
They'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of heist movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. Is this an express line? Can't let that train out of my sight. End of the line. I should head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. Heading for that office building. Man, I was hoping you were really Spider Man. That cheap suit ain't fooling anybody. Roman's ready and we are running late. Let's roll. They're on the move. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. I love it when a plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you so much. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man.
This tower. If I was available units, possible narcotics. As I warned, Nostradamus like. After Spider-Man recklessly took down Wilson Fisk without preparing for the consequences, our streets are now filled with aspiring gangsters, each trying to out-psycho the other. My next guest is lucky to have survived an armed robbery. Sir, we're glad you're okay. Thanks. It was nuts. These dudes walk in like they own the place, waving guns around. Appalling. When a businessman is afraid to make an honest living. Yeah, it was a lifesaver that Spider-Man came along and stopped him. Weren't you? That time. Spider-Man, take the heart. Knocking the ever-loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti-drug. I'll text Yuri the location. Cops will be here in no time. that come Chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. Knocking the ever loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti drug. Police will take it from here. You're done for. The hell is this crap? Wilson Fisk holds grudges. Who knew? That was sweet. They deserved it.
Magnifique. <laughs>